What's up guys, it's Meg, and today we're going over uh, The Walking Dead Season 4 Episode 11 promos. Um, the episode is called Claimed, and there are three AMC promos that I'm going to just really briefly review for you today. Um, I am not reviewing any of the Fox promos out there because they are known for spoilers, and that's where a lot of our most recent spoilers have come from. So I am avoiding those, and I am just going to review three promos from uh, AMC's network. So, there are two promos of Michonne and Rick, um, or Michonne, I guess. The first promo has Michonne and Rick in the kitchen of the house that they're currently staying at, and Michonne asks him, is this home or just a stop along the way? And I think it's because he hasn't made any mention, he probably hasn't made any mention of leaving. Um, and this is just so typical Rick. He is so set in trying to keep a hold of the past before uh, the zombie apocalypse happened. He's trying to, I get it because he has a child, but he's trying to create a home and it's just like in the second half season four promo where all the producers and directors were talking and they made mention of every time you find a home, you create a home, it ends up being destroyed. And yet Rick is still trying to do that and he's just like he's not gonna go look for anyone at least that's what the promo makes it seem like he's just content to stay in that house and pretend as if this is their new home and let's play house um, and it just really bothers me I know I've had issues with Rick for a while now and I know a lot of you love him I don't dislike him I just there are certain aspects of his character that I don't like and I really don't like everything that happened at the prison because of his decisions so I'm a little bit anti-Rick right now and I don't like that he is just willing to sit in this house and Michonne has to ask him if you know what the plan is um, it's just weird <laughs> like Rick come on you think you'd learn your lesson by now um, anyways she mentions he says he replies to her and says let's just stay here a while while we figure it out so it's not even really an answer um, and she says that she's gonna go off and look for supplies with Carl and he wants to go with and she says no um, and then the next promo that we see is of her in supposedly another house and she's looking at she unwraps a painting that looks as if it's been wrapped up you know for moving and it looks like it used to be a normal painting and then someone drew all over it and X'd out an eye and made the mouth look a little bloody. Um, I don't know what that was about, but as she's opening it, she then hears someone in the bathroom. And it's just really weird. I don't know if the person, the sounds that were coming from the bathroom didn't necessarily sound like walker sounds to me. Um, it maybe sounded like there was an actual person in there. Uh, of course they didn't show us anything once the door started to open so it's kind of up in the air but it looks like it's gonna give us some pretty good suspense in the next episode uh, and then in the promo number three we see um, quite a few people we don't see Daryl and Beth um, or Tyrese and the kids but we see uh, more of an intro to Abraham Eugene and Rosita and Abraham says we need people the more the better so that got me really excited because it kind of sounds like maybe their mission that they had in the comics is the same or is going to be somewhat the same in the in the TV show um, which we know a lot of times they bring in characters like Tyrese and it's just it's not the same they don't play the characters the same as the comics so it's kind of exciting to see that potentially Abraham Eugene and Rosita are on the same mission that they were on in the comics um, especially because Eugene has that satellite phone so I'm really really excited to see what the whole plan is with them um, so it looks like he's trying to recruit people I guess for his mission then it goes back to Rick and Michonne and Carl they're walking down train tracks so it looks like they leave the house that they were in and then we see Rick in a new house and it looks as if he's hiding like hiding under a bed or something and we see someone come in and then we see him leave the house like jump off the out a window and then he's hiding and crouched down by the side of the house and it looks as if someone has come in and they're actually people and not walkers that he's hiding from so it's a little bit scary um it does make me wonder if maybe they are going to bring the hunters in early um i don't know what do you guys think about that what are they hiding from what is in the bathroom um then we see that glenn is still worried about maggie and uh, it looks like he is holding someone. Is he holding Tara? He yells out, who did you see? But it's so quick. I tried to pause on it and I just couldn't get it. If you guys caught it in the promo, let me know. 
who you think it was he was talking to because I'm really like, I'm just confused and curious. Um, and I think that was it pretty much for the promo. Uh, I'm really excited. These episodes just seem to be getting better and better. I'm excited that they're not making us wait too long to go back to Rick and Carl and Michonne. Um, I like that we're going to get to see them so soon and they're not dedicating two episodes right off the bat to the other groups. But it does seem as if we're going to see some of the other groups as well. So uh, I'm really excited about it. What are you guys excited for in the next episode? Let me know in the comments below. And I will see you guys next Monday after I've watched the episode claimed. Hope you have a good week. Bye.